spent three months in Baltimore, which is the longest time we've ever worked in a while. We worked together on songs. Some of these newer songs kind of shifted and took a little bit longer to come into what they are now. Some of them went through like a few different, you know, like completely different styles on playing them. We never did that before. Usually it was like we would have one version of the song and if we played it on tour and it never sounded very good, we'd kind of just forget about it So record it. I feel like the improvised uh, element of this set is pretty small compared to like, I mean we don't even like change the set list at all. We really planned out this set to be one specific thing and I've always kept the, the songs in the order, the, the order that we started it out with when we were finishing up the practice session. It just sort of seemed like we had a, a goal to kind of uh, have the, the playing process feel a little bit less locked into sort of the rigidity of, of sample based stuff. I mean I think having Noah playing kits and like setting tempo and like having tempo be able to change throughout songs and just relying more on, on like live instrumentation or Dave playing a lot more keyboards and stuff so that there's, a, there's I think just like getting into the vibe of what it feels like to have a show feel or a song feel different like from night to night. <laughs> We're definitely aware that there's an expectation of us to play certain songs, especially a lot of songs maybe from Meriwether. We like writing new stuff so much and because our time is so limited together most of the time when we're, when we're writing and working that's really the focus really becomes working on the new stuff. A lot of times it has to do with like being able to fit songs together, you know, like for us a song like My Girls wouldn't fit like in this set of songs that would just seem out of place unless maybe we really, really we reworked it and that's just something we didn't want to do. Yeah.